All right then, so today we're going to be doing another Lord of Sequel Eye Challenge. And the challenge that we're going to be doing today is going to be called Green Dragon. So with Green Dragon, it's very similar to the other challenge that we have done in the past. So with this, it looks like uh, quotation marks is uh, being filtered out. So if we, for example, if we do uh, ID is equal to quotation marks, we get no hacks. So we got to find, find, find a way to bypass this. But thankfully, we did a challenge like this previously in the past. So how do we solve this? We simply need to put a question mark when ID is equal to, as you see right there, a backslash. Reason being is because I'll just grab this right here real quick and just uh, put it inside here, even though this is going to give a hint on what we're going to do later on. If I just do something like this and then just make a new line right here to show you guys. So you see what happens here is we get select ID from, from this database where ID is equal to this string. And this is going to be considered as an entire string until it reaches right here. Then what we could do after, just put like a hashtag right here. Then we could inject our SQL query right here. And in our case, we're going to use a union, select, and then a one and two. So if we do something like this and we change this to, I guess, uh, first name, right? We have here first name. And then we change this to the SQL test right here. And then I think that should be good. We just need to delete this. And then we just uh, execute the SQL. We get ID and two being placed right here. So that it's a valid query for the most part. So if we just copy, oh wait, I think we just need to copy this. Probably need to do percentage 23 for your own coding for the hashtag, like previous challenges. So ID is that, then we get and PW is equal to union select and then percentage 23. Whew. We see that ID gets matched as one and PW gets matched as two. So this is another SQL query we had to bypass because if you see right here, we see if the result is equal to ID, it goes inside this query. And now we need to have result ID equal to admin. So how do we do this? And it looks like only ID is being launched right here. So we don't need to put in two values. So what we could do is we see right here, union select one and two gets put, put right here. So except the one, we could probably replace this with uh with a with a backslash for the most part and then two what we could do is insert another union select so how we'll do the union select where we'll probably do something like uh select and then we'll just do uh oh wait no control z control z control yeah right here we'll do another union select and this time we just we we just need to select admin but we know that quotation marks aren't aren't like uh valid so we can't do id is equal to quotation marks admin so what we can do is represent it as a as a admin admin so because we can't represent it like that because uh, quotation marks are are canceled out so what we could do is like how we've been doing it in previous challenges we could just represent it as a hexadecimal so we can just go to string to hex and just click admin which i already have ready right here there's no spaces okay copy this change this to ox like that and then press enter and see what happens so it looks like we got some kind of error so we could just i guess copy this and see what we got wrong for the most part It might be the multiple union select statements, but who knows? I'll probably do it right here. So we see right here that union select and then union select. I what happens if we run this? Let's see. Uh, execute. You have an error. Check the math to correspond to your right syntax. So I'm guessing the error is right here. So what we could do is, what if we represent this as a hexadecimal instead, uh, the backslash, so I think backslash, 5C, OX, 5C. OX, 5C, and execute. Okay, that, that fixed that part. Now we have this entire part being uh, messed up. So we change this to union select uh where's backslash r 
O X five C. So now we have that correct. So the only thing that's being messed up is this union select ID is equal to that. So we noticed that by just changing it to a hexadecimal, it worked out. So what we could do is probably change this to a hexadecimal and see what happens. So do something like this. And then I guess just copy this and type, oh, string to hex. And just copy this and just insert it inside here instead. So we just delete all this out right here. Uh, probably not the hashtag, so we'll just probably be up to here. And then we'll just probably put it as an OX value at the end. Hopefully this works. Excuse you. Oh wait, the Green Dragon database does not exist. So I'm guessing it did work, it's just uh, this part didn't work. So we could change it to right here, this part. Oh. So we just change it to this. Oh my god. I'm really bad when it comes to technology. Control C, put it right here. Control V, and then we just execute the SQL. And looks like uh, unknown PW and field list. Oh, PW, so that will be, uh, we'll change it to first name. First name. Now we execute the SQL. And you see that it, it ran the code. So let's see, now all we need to do is just, uh, I just copy this part and see what happens. Uh, union select, yeah. Now if we run this, we get uh, union select. Uh, Twenty three. Where ID is equals union select ID. Is equal to is it that I spell this correctly? Oh, extra string admin or admin. So that worked out correctly. Ray string to uh, all right. Um, so we go back right here. So we do that comes this out, and then we get union select ID is equal to this hashtag huh this should work for the most part but let's check I have my, this is the query that worked last time for me uh no this is not the query that worked last time for me you need to like uh oh why is it not working percentage strings three this hashtag right here. I feel like that should be correct. But let me just guess this. Oh, I think I, I see what might have happened. Cause this is insanely large. We'll just change this to the string. Uh, string to hex and see what this actually. Or hex to string. Union select ID. Union select. Huh. Or oh, it might just only be union select and then we're not the ID. So we could just select the admin. Because the ID, since, oh yeah, yeah, since admin is going to be passed to ID. So I think this was the issue. So I think if you just, uh, if I copy this part and then go to uh, string to hex. Yeah, string to hex. And then go back right here and then just copy that, delete that and do O X and then insert this value and then boom we passed it because uh i guessing a union select admin so it selects admin but selects gets put inside here this id so now just uh, the id is going to equal to admin and then solves the green dragon so yeah yeah i think i guess that was it for this challenge for the most part the tricky part was just uh because we've done this in the past this 
quotation mark right here. I guess I think you guys were to know about, about the union select uh, operator and also how uh, you could double uh, uh, hex encode this. I guess hex encode this again so you can get this value right here so it could run successfully or else you just get errors for the most part. So yeah, that was about it for uh, Green Dragon. I hope you, hopefully I see you guys in the next video. Anyway, that's about it. Peace.